Well, the uh, F-35B uh, short takeoff vertical landing aircraft will be at the heart of our carrier uh, enabled power projection program. We're building two new uh, carriers, 900 foot uh, deck length carriers, but without catapults. So they are designed to work with these uh, aircraft and that will put the UK back in the carrier business and we're hugely looking forward to having that capability from uh, towards the end of this decade. It was fantastic to see it happen. I've, you know, like everybody else, I've seen the videos of uh, vertical landings on the WASP, but this is the first time I've seen uh, the aircraft in person uh, landing and flown by a British pilot. So obviously uh, the F-35 Joint Strike Fighter, or as we know it, the, the Lightning, brings a new fifth generation capability. What's particularly new for the UK is the stealth properties. We've never had a stealth aircraft before. Uh, that'll bring us uh, much better capability with regards to survivability, but also much better access uh, where we can go places and have effect uh, where hitherto we've not been able to do that. We've been uh, stalwart supporters of the F-35 program. As you know, we're tier one partners with the US uh, in the program. Thousands of jobs in the UK are dependent uh, on this program and some of the technology that's gone into the aircraft has been developed in the UK by BAE Systems. Defence programs generally, and this is one of the most important ones, uh, typically sustain the high end of our engineering uh, industry and high end development skills. And it is crucially important for us to keep that skill base uh, together and the F-35 program, together with our own Typhoon fighter jet uh, program, uh, support the skills base and support the top end of our engineering industry and we, we want to keep it that way.